What's up everyone, it's your boy, Samuel Sinach, coming back at you with another brand new video. Oh yes, today is surgery day, I am getting surgery on my collarbone today, and they're going to put the plate in today, and the time of surgery is, it's 6.34 now, it's 6.34 in the morning, 6.34 a.m. I'm scared, honestly. I don't think anybody who's watching this right now likes being knocked out. Period. I hate it. I'm like the one person who literally is the world's biggest hater of anesthesia. And I can't drink coffee. I can't even eat this morning. I can only drink clear fluids until after surgery. need to relax because I know it's gonna go by like that it's gonna go by so quick once I'm under and then once I'm awake it's over I'll have a big bandage on my arm I'll probably have to lay the stitches in for two to three weeks before they have to take them out which I will not be put under anesthesia for that it's just the feeling of going under, you have no idea, it's the unknown, I hate the unknown. No, I'm not gonna say I hate is a strong word, I'm gonna say I don't like the unknown. I really don't like the unknown. I know, you, I know all my friends who are watching this right now are praying for me and who are sticking through me through this are going to really help me through this. My parents are worried for me. I'm worried. The scary part is that it's the fear of waking up during surgery and the second fear is not waking up after surgery. Which I know one of them is going to happen and the other one isn't the one that's going to happen is I'm going to wake up after surgery. The one that's not going to happen is I'm not going to wake up during surgery. Hope to God I don't. It's just today. It's just today just today it'll be over it'll all be over tonight surgery is sometime this morning probably at like 9 or 10 most likely 9.30 The nurses are going to be really nice. They're going to hold my hand while I get knocked out by anesthesia. I'm sorry guys, um, just thinking about it, that's all. If I take a long pause, I'm just thinking about I'm just scared guys, very scared. I'm scared of the IV, I'm scared of the anesthesia, I'm scared of the surgery, I'm just scared of everything that's gonna happen today.
I'm gonna have a big bandage right here once they're done on this collarbone. And the plate will be in. That'll be the end of it. But the pain level is gonna be a whole different story. I don't know how bad the pain level will be. But I know the pain level will be up there. It'll be close to what it felt like when I broke my collarbone. But I'll be on hydrocodone, which is a very, very strong pain drug, which will really help and probably knock me out again when I get home. Because they're going to give it to me, and I'm going to be really dosed up but I'm gonna sound really loopy if I make a video. You'll probably see some weird things. Like, I have no idea because I'm not gonna remember any of it. Because that's what the anesthesia does. Just know this. And I love each and every one of you on this channel. Except for the scammers. But the true fans out there, I love all of you. Each and every one of you. All of my friends at school, love you. All of my friends that grew up from the kindergarten to 12th grade. And who are in college right now, I love you who are watching this. And everybody else who I grew up with from kindergarten to 12th grade who are watching this, I love you you just know that and i'm so happy you guys are praying for me and everything just keep supporting me through this because i know it's going to be over before i know it so yeah One of the nurses said they'll hold my hand while I'm being knocked out by the anesthesiologist. And I really want to ask the anesthesiologist several questions. But I'm probably going to be stopped by several questions because I'm going to be knocked out. And they're probably going to tell me to count back. And that's the part that's really going to scare me. Because when you count back, you have no idea when you're going to... When the lights are going to go out. You just have to rely on the numbers like this. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. Just like that. Well, hopefully it's just like that. It's not going to look just like that, like I close my eyes and I can't just see light. No, it's going to be nothing like that. It's going to be complete oblivion. Or whatever you call it, the abyss. Once I'm out. I think I'm going to be seeing as the abyss for the next two seconds. And then hopefully, 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 hopefully I'm awake. I don't want to be under anesthesia any longer than I have to. And I don't want to be under anesthesia any longer than what it feels like when I'm under. I want it to feel like two seconds because I want to be awake. I have a fear of being forced to be put to sleep. I have a fear of not being able to wake up. I actually have a big phobia of anesthesia, those of you who don't know. I also have a phobia of surgery. But thank you all so much for supporting me through this. And this is where I cut it off. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like this video, if you guys want more videos in the future, smash the like button, turn that notification bell, subscribe so you get notified every time I upload a new video. And if you're new here and this is the first time you're seeing my face again don't forget to like subscribe turn the notification bell so you get notified every time i upload a new video all right love you all peace